UNSW's world-class cancer researchers have been hailed as the true heroes of the story behind the new Lowy Cancer Research Center. In opening the center, Prime Minister Kevin Rudd acknowledged both the academic excellence of the research team and the generosity of Frank Lowy and family, who contributed $10 million towards this world-class facility. The great thing about this university is it's a celebration of academic excellence. Philanthropy plays a huge part in this. And uh, what he has done, not just here, but in philanthropic works right across this city and right across this country, he has been there supporting pioneering medical research. But philanthropist Westfield Chief Frank Lowy typically played down his role. All we did is sign a cheque. Fortunately, we have it, and we do it willingly, and we do it with pleasure. But the people that are work and do the job, they are the heroes. The official opening was attended by the New South Wales Premier, Christina Keneally, representatives from both sides of politics, UNSW Chancellor David Gonski and Vice-Chancellor Professor Fred Hilmer. And today we begin, we begin a new world-leading approach to cancer research and treatment here at UNSW. And you often think that the thousands of people who pass by here every day may have no appreciation of the extraordinary and often miraculous work that's going on inside these buildings. The Lowy Cancer Research Centre is Australia's first facility bringing together researchers from childhood and adult cancer. A collaboration between UNSW and Children's Cancer Institute Australia, the Lowy Cancer Research Centre brings together 400 scientists under one roof. If we are to be very good at only one thing, it will be our ability to translate our discoveries at the bench into new diagnostics and treatments for cancer. What makes this building unique is the integration of adult and childhood cancer research at a single site, which provides uniquely fertile ground for cross-fertilising the research ideas from one group to the other, and then, as Phil has indicated, rapidly translating that into the clinic. So what brings us together is not a sense of hopelessness, but a sense of determination and hope to do something about it led by our great team of researchers and scientists and clinicians and those who come after them as students. Three cancer-fighting drugs developed by the centre will be in clinical trials this year. It is with great pride and with great confidence, therefore, that I declare the Lowy Cancer Research Centre officially open. <laughs>